Hi, good morning. Today is the 21st of February 2023. My name is Shashi Prabhu and I come to you with series 2 of Life Happenings. So today I am going to talk about uh, the mornings, morning toughness. Uh, yesterday uh, and day before yesterday I covered, you know, uh, life happenings in, the, uh, in my life on the writer's blog. So today I talk about, you know, morning toughness. And some mornings are like this, uh, like the one today, the inbuilt alarm goes off before you are really off uh, and the long stretches and the lip rotations and the hip rotations feel much better. Uh, the warm up, you know, works up a sweat, the kettle whistles and uh, the thought of sipping um, coffee feels really good. Morns like this, I imagine sitting on sandy shores, the wind in my face with a flask of black coffee, a book to read my workbook and uh, the sun rays skim the water, the golden color trickles into the blueness of the waves and I sit in trance wanting to submerge myself and to forget who I am and only to find myself in very different ways. So I dream, you know, um, I dream of doing this so many times. So today is such morning that I sit myself uh, facing my window and I dream such things. I dream to tread um, softly on wet sands as the sun rises uh, further to feel the sensation that nothing lasts forever and this is just the beginning. I dream of speaking my heart aloud and let the queerness fade away in oblivion and letting small pebbles that lie tucked in sand know that I like my coffee black and my days bright as I walk across the sands to the nearby shrubbery. I dream of my bare feet in green grass with the languid winds of moist air caressing my body with grace and each swirl of uh, breathing air uh, earth into me. So I dream of mornings like this to wake up without anxiety filled with gratitude and humbleness to see the sparkle in my eyes with glee in the puddle between the marigold and the hibiscus flowered plants. As I look around in my dreams it feels that the world is asleep and only I am awake. I dream that everything is tangible as I touch my forefinger into my surroundings, the texture of the grass, the lightness of the wind, the aroma of salt, the shrill calls of the gulls, the hues of the flower get encapsulated in the palms of my hand. I dream that this is real and I forget because now it is me, the sands, the water, the greenery, the sunshine and my black coffee. As it dawns to me, I open the large windows right ahead of me wide and look into the trees and the cobbles on the street, the pathways that are drying themselves after the light February dew. Mornings like this are strangely quiet outside. Just now, outside Hirandani Meadows is quiet and serene. There's hardly any traffic. I can see the garden. These moments are when I am at peace with myself and inside, I am understanding that there is something lacking. Building morning toughness by inconveniencing myself is something that comes to mind. Cycling early morning or walking or some free exercises depending on which one of the three I don't like to do for the moment. Some mornings I like this, put myself to inconvenience and expect the price I pay with inconveniencing my, myself is the morning toughness. We always pray for a better tomorrow and when tomorrow comes, we pray for a better tomorrow rather than enjoying. So I inconvenience my mornings for toughness, for enjoying my today. I am not very good at it, but I am getting there. I dream that I will get myself to enjoy to my today. I look forward to all my mornings like this. Signing off from Hiranani Meadows Thane, Shashi Prabhu. Have a nice day ahead.